Hi, and welcome to the video where we will show you how to focus on your day-to-day -day sales activities in Zoho CRM. Whether or not you're a salesperson, you will still find this video very beneficial. A typical salesperson is interested in managing their pipeline and their tasks throughout the day. This is where the Home tab of Zoho CRM is very beneficial. The fully customizable Home tab can pull data from the other sales modules. In this particular example, you can see the sales pipeline, as well as your open tasks, closed tasks, and overdue tasks. As the salesperson, you'll be using the task management system in Zoho CRM to plan out your day. Let's go ahead and click on the first task. The CRM will then take us to the activities module where you can view the rest of the task details. This task is in reference to a callback for a potential. Navigate to the Potentials page and make your call. As the conversation moves along, your goal as a salesperson is to close the deal or move the prospect to the next stage. Once the call is completed, it is a good idea to add a note. This is for your own benefit so when you come back to the contact page, you can see what happened during past calls. Click on Note and summarize the conversation and then save that note. Another good practice to follow is to send an email as well. A pop-up window will allow you to either manually type the email or to choose from an existing template. The email has been sent, your notes has been written, and your fields have been updated. Don't forget to close the task. You can close the task from both the Activities tab or from the Potentials page under the Open Activities section. Now that the task is closed, navigate back to the Home tab and work on the next task for the day. Your next task for the day is in reference to an email from the customer. Look to the top right and click on the mail magnet icon. Here you will see a list of all of the recently received emails from your existing customers. Let's go ahead and click on the email. It looks like this customer is ready to purchase. It's time to call the customer and close your deal. Navigate to the contact page and give your customer a ring. While you're on the phone with the customer, Navigate to the related potential, make sure to indicate the correct amount of the sale, verify the closing date is today, update the stage to closed one, and save the potential. As always, add a note to summarize the call. Now that the task is complete, make sure you go back and actually close the task from the activities menu, go back to the home tab. The next task on your list is a request for a product demo. Click on the task to view more details as well as what lead it is related to. Now go ahead and click on the lead's name. Scroll down on the leads page to the Open Activities section and click on New Event. A pop-up window will open allowing you to put the description of the event and schedule it. For the subject, we're going to put Product Demo. Indicate the start and end date and time. Notice in the CRM you can also add a notification. This is a good practice so you don't forget when events are coming up throughout the week. Click on the Reminders section and indicate how soon you want to be reminded and whether or not you want it to be a pop-up or an email. You must be logged into the CRM to view the pop-up reminders. You can also go back and add a further description for the event and any other fields you wish to fill in. Now go ahead and save the event. The event has been scheduled. Make sure to close the task on the same page. It should be right under the Open Activities section, so you can easily just hit Close. To double check the event on the calendar, scroll back up the page and click on the calendar icon on the top right. You can see it on a daily, weekly, or monthly view. Let's go ahead and click on the monthly view. As you can see on the calendar, our event has been scheduled. Now navigate back to the Home tab and you will see one final task for the day. This task is in reference to a completed product demo. What you are going to do in this case is convert this lead into a contact and place them in your sales pipeline as this particular person is interested in your product now that the demo is completed. Click on the task. To the right you will see the lead that this task is related to, so go ahead and click on their name. On the lead page, you will have the option to convert at the very top. Remember, a lead converts into a contact. A contact is someone who you are pursuing an opportunity with. At the same time, you also want to create this opportunity, and this is called a potential. Go ahead and click on Convert. Once you click on the Convert button, you will notice the lead's company becomes the account name. The lead's first and last name become the contact's name. These two sections are related to each other. 
you also have the option to create your potential or sales opportunity. Go ahead and check the box. Next, select an expected closing date. The most important part is to place it into your sales pipeline, so hit the down arrow on the sales stages and place it in the appropriate stage. If you know the amount of the sale, go ahead and fill in the amount field as well. Once this information is in the system, go ahead and click Convert. You will now notice that the lead has been converted into a count, contact, and a potential. After you convert the lead to the contact, click on the contact's name. Scroll down to the activity section and notice your task has still followed through. Make sure you close this task because you have officially converted this lead over and placed it into your sales pipeline. Once you have completed the task, navigate back to your home tab. You will now notice there are no more tasks for today. Every single task that you have completed is now placed under the closed task list instead. Another place that you can view this list is in the activities tab. You can change the filter to close tasks and you will see those same closed tasks on this list as well. I hope you have learned how useful task management is in Zoho CRM by watching this video.